Hi, I'm Jenny Koob. I'm the VP of Customer Acquisition for Sosa. We're based in Mountain View, California, and we're a website performance analytics company. When I started with Sosta about a year ago, we basically were a Marketo and a Salesforce shop. And I had some search marketing happening in the background, we we're doing retargeting, but I had to ask myself, what's the one thing I want to add to my tech stack this year? And I've only added one thing to my tech stack this year and it's Terminus. So a big factor in deciding whether or not we wanted to add Terminus to our tech stack was, do we have the person on board that can do the care and feeding? And candidly, you're looking at the person that is doing that care and feeding. I'm logging into Terminus, I'm creating the campaigns, I'm uploading the ads, and the process for me was uh, pretty seamless. The reason why we brought in Terminus is because we kind of had a gap in our digital strategy. What do I mean by that? I mean, we were doing, you know, Google paid search, we're doing retargeting, but we didn't have a way to holistically cover our target accounts at scale. And so by implementing Terminus and creating different campaigns to target different personas, different vertical markets, that's just something we couldn't do before with kind of our traditional digital strategy. Once we implemented Terminus, we again started kind of small and we grew over time. And the beauty with Terminus is, is you can kind of set up a lot of different custom campaigns. It's not a set and forget and there's good best practices on how to refresh your campaigns and how to continue to get better ROI. But what I was able to do is certainly A-B test a lot of different things and kind of find that sweet spot and then kind of double down there. And so uh, it gives you kind of that flexibility of being able to try different things, kind of get those metrics and then figure out what's working, what's not quickly. So you're not just throwing a bunch of money at it. You're actually getting the best ROI depending on what the, your objectives are. And we've been able to really kind of go deeper with maybe a smaller set of campaigns versus you know going kind of high level with 20 campaigns. Initially, when we brought on Terminus, the need was a target account uh, you know, strategy, target account coverage. But very quickly, we realized there were so many other ways you could use Terminus to help. We're using Terminus, for example, for a pipeline velocity campaign. So I've got active ads running right now that are helping opportunities, whether they're in stage one or stage five, accelerate through that process. We've also got something I call um, my resurrection uh, project. This is where we're taking closed lost opportunities and trying to resurrect them and get them back into the active opportunity stages so that sales can maybe have another shot at them. With Terminus and the reporting piece, what we're doing is we're kind of looking at our reach and how it's impacted the reach. And so there's kind of three takeaways there. I would say, number one, as I mentioned, we haven't had good reach historically around marketing, the marketing function and the C-level function. And we're noticing that by being able to leverage Terminus for that reach, we're seeing faster acceleration with our opportunity stages. So for example, if you look at a year ago, how long did it take a digitally sourced opportunity to close? It's about 95 days. Now we can look at those same opportunities from a digital source and it's gone down about 57 days. And I honestly believe that's just because we've increased our reach and what I call shots on goal. And that's just kind of accelerating the whole process.